Hello viewers, <clears throat> this is my another video. Cylinder head finally is on the on the table. So first thing, if you taking your uh, cylinder off, cylinder head off, you want to check if it's flat. Any damage? Of course, we know from previous uh, video that. This cylinder head had have a problem with the head gasket, which is blown in here. And I know that engine was overheated, so there was two indications for that. First was uh, this section of head bolts; they uh, they become. They came off very quickly, like no uh, tension, no no big force to remove them. So that gave me thinking, oh, there's something wrong. And of course, the other thing was that there's a there's a crack on the on the gasket. So first thing, what what you want to do when you're removing a cylinder head or doing any job on the engine, check for flatness. I'm, I know that this cylinder head is uh, warped and I show you how to check it I just I had this like few I bought this few years ago it's a very simple ruler it's aluminium it's maybe not the perfect uh, flat bar you can get but it works because I checked uh, the block with this and it's fine, the block is fine. And I checking the same spot on the cylinder head and I show you something now. The middle bit doesn't even touch the cylinder head. You can put uh, zero, zero two of a mill so that's a lot as you can see it doesn't touch the cylinder head so this cylinder head is warped so first thing what you want to check is your flatness so then you can decide what to do next or you gonna call the machine shop and they will tell you if it's possible to fix it or not how much it's gonna cost you second option is uh, just to get uh, another cylinder head probably in better condition because this is uh, this is a cylinder head from uh, M52 TU BMW engine which had no uh, no history maintenance history at all Everything is uh, worn on this engine, except of uh, the piston rings. As you can see on the other video, the clearances on the piston rings are still fine. Pistons are looking fine, but that's the only part of this engine which is good. So as you can see, this cylinder head is not looking good. So thanks for watching and I hope you're gonna watch another video more about this cylinder head. I'm gonna show you more bits, what you should be looking after and how to remove camshafts and other bits. So thanks for watching.